Greetings and welcome to episode 6 of my Empire Total War Darth Mod Great Britain campaign. And this, my friends, I we left the last time where we had a tremendous series of battles here for Paris, for France. The first fight was with this force here that has been retreated to this uh, Patois farmland here. As you can see, this army was soundly thrashed. Um, as it tried to retake um, Paris, it was a real tough battle, my friends, where they just absolutely threw themselves at the walls, trying to retake it as quickly as they could. But we managed to hold, we managed to fend them off and throw them back from the very gates of Paris. Then there was a rebellion. Then the rebellion. And this was the army that came in. But this army was came in with some very, very nice units indeed. The Swiss infantry was particularly hard to beat. But again, with only a minimal amount of men, we managed to throw them back. But at great, great cost, we lost a lot of good men. A lot of good men here defending Paris. But what we did manage to do, after we saw off these two assaults against Paris, we managed to bring in five brand new regiments here which have pretty much solidified our hold on Paris which is absolutely vital. It's vital that we hold Paris. Now although they're, they're raiding these cities and these towns here we have to let them do that. The main goal of this is just simply to hold Paris. If we hold Paris it means that we have pretty much ripped out the heart of the French Empire. Without it their money, their income will suffer and also it gives us a the ability to be able to strike at the French or the reigning French territories that they do have so we're not going to allow them at all at all to come back and take Paris and take France. We're going to hold and contain France with the force we have in Paris and in Britain back in London I am starting to build up a second force here, secondary forces not large at the moment, but I'm just beginning the groundwork here for this force. This force is going to be landing in Brussels and it's going to be taking this Flanders from the French. I intend to link these two uh, regions together and this is then going to remove quite a powerful force and quite a powerful infrastructure from the French. They still can produce quite good units in, in around these areas here so it's not to be sniffed at. I want to try and remove as much as I can of this French force and the French potential for you know hitting us quite hard as it were and they've got the very governor's barracks here and this is where they're getting their troops from is right here look at that Royal Royal Dupont regiment that's a pretty tough regiment most of whoa these are me, these are pretty good here. So this Strasbourg looks like where is the main sort of staging point. But I want to take, I want to take Brussels. I want to come in. I want to take all of the sort of the sea air, the seaboard here, this area here, this coastal line. I want it right up to my allies. I'll then have the Dutch as my allies on my sort of right flank, as it were. So quick look. I'm going to repair this here because I want to get the trade coming in here. As you can see, we do have the French here trading port. They're still bringing money here. Ottoman Empire as well, so I want to get ours up and running. But these are going to be raiding on and off. I'm going to let it happen. I know it's just no, it's nothing I can really do about it yet. I don't have the forces to do that. I must hold Paris at all costs. Um, I probably can start producing some units in Paris if needs be, and that will then enable me to push on a bit further. I also got this Spanish fleet here, which is going to be a right pain. I need to deal with it. I need to deal with it very, very soon. So we've managed to build up quite a st substantial navy here and we've also got uh, these two ships are one seven uh, we've got a, um, a fifth rate we've got a, sh a fourth rate ship line in the Somerset we've also got another uh, sh fourth rate ship of the line in production now one more turn so we've got for combine this fleet we should have enough ships here to deal with this Spanish Armada and also to deal with this ship here which is pretty much, well it is blockading um, Bristol which is pretty much restricting now quite a lot of our trade but we're still bringing in 2859, not a lot yet but still we'll, we'll, we can we can look past that once we've dealt with that ship there so I might try and come through here get past here and try and take this out here but I need to build my navy up as well a bit more and also in India we do have this force here which did deal with the French here in Katak, which pretty much removed any French presence in India. 
and we're slowly starting to build, build these up a bit by bit. It's going to take a bit of time because, okay, of course, our money is split between Europe and again, the war was forced upon us. We did not look for this war. This war was thrust upon us by the French. So we're st slowly bringing this up to f up to um, full spec, as it were. And then this army will then launch an attack against the Marathon rebels. All right here, as you can see, they got some decent lancers here. Uh, rabble and camel cavalry. So we're going to deal with those and take Nagpur. That will then increase our trade and our hold over this corner of India. It's vital we get ourselves firmly established in India because this is our ultimate goal. India is my primary goal. Not, not Russia, not anywhere else, not Europe, not the Americas. India. If I can take the wealth of India, it'll just open up a whole pot of gold for us. It'll oil the war machine beyond anything you can possibly imagine. It really will. It's going to be a tough fight though because the Marathans are dug in very, very well here. Um, so let's end them. What is the best thing we can do? Let me just have a quick look at any more diplomacy can be done with anybody else. I don't believe so. I think everything else is cut off. The trade routes, yep. Okay, I'm going to end the turn and let's see what comes our way. Speed up the French now. Look, they're build, starting to build up some forces here. That Whoa, ho, ho, wait a minute. Don't do it, France. Don't do it. Ah, look at this. See this? They're continuing to raid. All the time they're going to raiding everything I've got here. But I must not flinch. I must not move from Paris until that reserve fleet comes over. That reserve army comes over. As soon as I get that reserve army, I, then I can really start packing a punch. And starting to remove the sort of the, the remains of the French in Europe. I want to completely clear the French out of Europe in its entirety because that will then allow me to focus and concentrate purely on India. It'll also give me ex excellent conditions with which to fight in India. Don't please go to Sweden. Don't go to Sweden. Oh, look at that. Sweden have got some huge forces. And they're in a titanic fight with Russia. Thirteen colonies. Trying to incite a religious unrest. Mughal Mysore. Portugal might be going for Spain. Might be going for Spain. Now that would be an interesting, really interesting fight there. And they are an ally of ours, so that would benefit us hugely. Whoa! Whoa, Westphalia, what are you doing? Don't blockade, don't don't disrupt the trade. There it is, there it is. I I mean well oh no 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 no. That's okay. French rebels, but <laughs> excellent. Four four seven. So now where's that oh oh wooden has gone. Oh, look at that. Prussia. Prussia have absolutely stretched their must flex their muscles there. Wow. They're moving in real close. So I need to start looking here. Prussia. Unf oh, unfriendly. Oh, they don't like us. They don't like us at all. Damn, they got a lot of stuff there. Now they're at war with Austria. That looks like Austria is getting itself really squeezed in pretty hard here. So I intend to help Austria if I can. I'm going to give them ring bayonets. I gave them ring bayonets. I'm going to help them out militarily if I can. Oh they've, t oh, they've lost Munich. They've only got Vienna left. Oh, damn, they're really squeezed. I need to keep the Prussians away from me. I can't... I cannot have another war with Prussia. I really can't. Whew. Okay. I've got 1857 here as our... When will this force be ready here? Put it... Ah. 
a lot, but John Churchill. Look at that. What a what a commander. Absolutely phenomenal. Oh yes, yes indeed. And here actually let's check here well, Scotland in Scotland you can produce some phenomenal troops. And we're gonna get ourselves we need horse here. Regiment of horse. We need to free up this here if possible. That's what I am gonna do in the Irish Sea here. Is I'm gonna send these gentlemen around to here. Under sail. We are gonna prepare to eliminate this Spanish fleet. Gonna come out to here. Next, I could take these out here. We've got some really nice ships here. Let's have a look what they got. Nothing to really match that. We've got three two eight threes. Two. We got three four three eighters. Three fifth three eighters, and we got admiral ships as well. So we do outgun them. I need to remove this one as well from here. It's going to be a tough, tough fight, but I just wish the. Oh, look at that! Nothing coming in here. That's why the Dutch remove Westphalia. Please, if you would, I'm just going to help the the Dutch out as well. Um. Gonna help them out there and allow them to or let them build some better barracks so they can get some better troops. Imagine they spent a lot of money there on that. That's it, that's an incredible money money spent there. Okay. Twenty-four thousand they spent on that. That's a crazy amount of money. Okay, so I'm actually going to probably abandon that there and get rid of it. I'm going to leave all these on fire because all they'll do is keep coming around just attacking everything. Right, let's end this turn. Um, I can't really put anything into that other one in India. I haven't got a money yet. I've got to focus on Europe and then switch to India. Oh, that's a that's a whopping great big army that's being built there. Whoa, that's okay. That's all right. Let them carry on raiding. Now, I've given Austria as much help as I possibly can. Yes, thank you very much. <laughs> Success being forced upon us, and we are going to auto resolve, please. Yes. Oh, ho, 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 ho! Thank you very much, good sir. But we're going to take the money. Thank you very much. You just clear off Spain. You just clear off. Yes, we did it. It costs us a lot. It costs us a lot in, in terms of our navy, but we did it. We gave that fleet a damn good thrashing there. So I've got to c continue my fleet production. I cannot allow it to go down. Russia. Oh dear, Portugal hit. Why are you doing this to me, Russia? Why? Colony still going, still going strong. They haven't given up the fight yet. Persia. Oh, dearie, dearie me. Cherokee nations. Westphalia, don't do it, Westphalia. Just allow them to do whatever they want here. Ooh, excellent. That's more like it. 
and we are going to clear this. Yes. <laughs> wow, we took a real beating there. Holy smokes. Uh, so what we are going to do is move into here. Ship's orders received. And we are going to repair these here. Cheapest creepers, that took a real battering, that did. What we are going to do is begin recruitment there of some more ships. We've got f oh, we've got three of those, we can't need more of that. Uh, military Academy, what? Oh, hoo -hoo. 3,000 in there, that would be absolutely phenomenal. get all of these because these are veterans I'm then going to build this up but we've got our trade lines open once again oh look at that <laughs> excellent now I'm going to put some money into military academy what's it going to give me here in, in England here oh heavy, ooh, heavy cav heavy cav and what about here? What's it going to give us here? Heavy cab or Royal Highland few Royal Highland Grenadiers. Oh my word, that is spectacular. Uh, I'm going to invest in it. Five turns, and I'm going to invest my money in that. Another regiment here. Now these gentlemen, why aren't they up to full scratch yet? Oh, of course he's still repairing there, so. But this is quite a formidable army. Now I'm, I'm imagining the French are going to come for us here. I think the French are going to hit us here in Paris. Oh, what have they got? Royal Palace here. What can they get? Royal Ecossais Regiment Estrange is Gendarmerie Carboniers. Oh, they haven't got that yet. But what about? Can I still help out Austria at all? Can I help out Austria with anything else? I'll give the military syllabus as well. I need a strong... I need a strong Austria to be able to hold Prussia off. Yeah, I see they're at war with Prussia. So I've got to make sure that I do the right thing here on the United Provinces. Make sure the Dutch are well are seen to okay as well. See if I can get something off them. <laughs> All right, I'll just make sure they're okay. So I'll give them improved grenades. This should allow them to be able to get some decent units here. I just hope the they're doing something good with what I've given them. Let's have a look. Are they grading their barracks? Nope, they're not. By damn! Look at that. That's in absolute tatters here. It's probably a rebellion going on here. But I wish the Austrians would throw something in. Into um, some of their production facilities. <coughs> and, you know, get some barracks going. They need the barracks upgraded. Hopefully that will allow them to do it. Because I do need them. Because, I tell you what, the Prussians are so close. Were they else are they at war with anyone else? Oh great, they're at war with the United Provinces. Marvellous. Don't tell me I've got to prop them up as well. I'm going to give them carbines. You need to upgrade your barracks and you need to do it very quickly. Okay, let's 
Um, if I can upgrade anybody here. Two hundred nine. That's not too bad. So I'll do that. Slowly upgrading here. I'm expecting a counterattack by the French pretty soon. Let's end this turn. Let's see what happens here. <clears throat> we could be up against quite a formidable foe here in the turn in, in Prussia. Really formidable. Um, as you can see, they're just going to be striking all the time at us. If they're coming for Paris, oh look at that! They're right outside Paris. Right outside Paris. Come on, Netherlands, come on, hold it, hold it together. Don't do it, don't do it, Spain. Don't you dare do it. I mean, well, knew it. Oh, jeez. You just leave one gap in your defences and they just absolutely plunder you. That's a lot of troops moving up through Russia. A lot. Oh, what's going on here? Yeah, why not? Stay in their good books. And a thousand is a thousand. Whoa, yes. Nicely done, 13 colonies. Trying to help out my allies as well in this one. The main reason I'm doing that as well is so I can keep my allies strong so they hold off my enemies, if you understand what I mean. Come on now, don't do it. Don't f don't buckle now. You stay with us, du you're the Dutch. You stay with us, Netherlands. You stay with us. Don't you go. Oh, hoo hoo hoo. We have a gentleman. Looks like we. Oh, wait a minute. What can we steal here? Let's try that, shall we? Excellent. Yeah, yeah, yeah. to rid ourselves of this pesky Spanish <laughs> ship. We, are victorious. we should take the money. Orders, Captain. Aye, aye, Captain. We're losing some good ships here. I'm actually going to recruit a fifth fleet from here, and oh, at last he's back up to full. Excellent. This army is holding Paris. It shall not move. And actually, oh, one more. Where can I get Royal Welsh? Probably army board. Army board level. Um, yeah. Oxford, we're getting explosive shells. Oh, that'll definitely be a boon to us. It'll also allow us to get great arsenal here, which should unlock the 12 pounder, which we definitely do need. And then this is going to allow us to get the military academy which will open up a lot oh yes the cavalry which is great for us as well nope gotta keep focus I have to stay absolutely focused on what I'm doing here so recruitment is going to continue apace 
one more cavalry here and I think we'll have a 12 pounder it's going to take a long time to get this army up to scratch here because we are sort of fighting against the odds as it were that's more like it Not much action at the moment yet, my friends, because I want to try and get this up as quickly as I can. Sort of get my forces back into position. As you can see here, this is, this is quite an elite army here. I'm hoping and praying they are upgraded. Oh, they are. Thank. Oh, thank you. They're actually upgrading their barracks. Because the technology I gave them is actually enabled them to upgrade their barracks. So they may be able to hold what's going on here. And hopefully repair that as well. I, I pray they do. And what about the Austrians? Are they doing anything at all? Oh, yes, they are as well. Oh, thank you. Ah, phew. Okay, at least they're doing something. Right, let's end the turn. <laughs> What'll Austria do, I wonder? Can they fight back? Excellent. So it's a full, a full stack, a Dutch force there in Amsterdam. That should hold off pretty much anything coming their way, which is good. And now the Ottomans, who seem to be throwing a lot of troops up to the north, our Russia. Where are you going, good sir? Hopefully to leave Portugal alone. Of course, read the trade line. Oh. Oh ho ho. <laughs> Excellently done. The 13 colonies, you've got to tip your hat to them. They really are doing their bit. Whoa. Imagine if 13 colonies got Quebec. Wow, that would be an absolute inspiration. Okay, you just keep moving in and out to do what you want to do. Whoa, 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 why is that happening? Why did that happen? Why would you do that? Oh, look at that. Fire by rank. Yes. <laughs> well done, good sir, well done. I think we'll send our other agent in here, our other gentleman. I think we should steal some other... Without further delay. And what else should we steal from them? Let's see if we can get the flying shuttle. up and running these farms to increase our income in that respect so that's good 350 add a little bit of wealth there to the to the coffers Underway. Awaiting further orders. Set sail. that is an elite Force. Look at that, that is very nice. What we've got coming in 5154. Why do you break trade with us? I tell you what, I shall. 
I should throw him plug bane it. Okay, not a problem. I'm sure there are others possibly that would want to trade with Persia. What about Persia? Uh, we'll throw in some technology for him. <laughs> Excellent. So that's boosted that. We do have a lot of raiding going on here. A lot of raiding. But that's fine. It'll just have to burn. I'm not ready yet to strike out. Oh, Royal Welsh. That's what I'm talking about. That is what I'm talking about. We should get another 12 pounder. And some line infantry. We start to slowly build up this force here. Probably have three cannon. Hoping the Dutch will be able to hold out. Yes, they're doing it. They're absolutely upgrading it. Can I help them out any more? give them that as well, just for their ships. Um, Sweden can just clear off basically, I don't want any of their goods. If they don't want to bother with us, I shall not bother with them. Research has been put on hold here. Fire by rank is definitely going to be required because... Let's end the turn. <laughs> oh, here we go, here we go. Unbelievable, unbelievable. I'm probably going to lose this fleet now. Yes! Yes! We did it. Oh, my word, we actually held this fleet has been a marvel. This is why I don't repair things. I just leave them run their course. Because there's no point. They'll just keep getting raided and raided and raided. Spain, don't do it, Spain, don't do it, don't do it. The oceans are ours. <laughs> these are going to be repaired, these gentlemen. And added to. Prussia, what are they going to do? Ottomans up. Looks like they're surging forward here into Austrian territory, possibly. Thirteen colonies moving back into their position. Oh, they could take Quebec off the march. So Portugal might be aiming for somebody. I might even help Portugal out. Whoa, there, sunshine. Oh, yes. I cannot repair that, so we will just have to simply... Wait a minute. Are there any colleges? I want to send them out to steal some technology, possibly. I think it's going to be... Let's pop that in there. They seem to have left that alone. Okay, we've got 7394. I would be doing a disservice if I didn't start to increase our fleet here.
<laughs> this army again is going to oh, it's coming together very nicely here now with a 12 pounder um, another horse I think another cavalry unit it's coming together very nicely now so we have three cavalry units three artillery pieces um, we definitely need a general so I have to get a general next time as well Ooh, ah, drats let's get him back in there to start stealing some other stuff I wouldn't mind that thank you very much Kingston, yeah, that's fine. Actually, I could send this agent out. Does Prussia have anything that we could use? Got explosive shell, but... Ooh, they've got a lot of that. Which I think we're going to probably go and have a look at. I'm going to see if I'm going to take any, pr any Prussia's... Immediately. I'm hoping that the Dutch are producing... Oh yeah, we're starting to see the rise of the Dutch again. Yep, they're coming back. The Dutch. Wait a minute. Yes. That's more like it. Well done. Uh, I think give them socket a bayonet. And I'm also going to help out. Can I help out the Austrians any further? Give them socket bean it as well. I know I could probably ask for something in return, but I'm not really in for. Oh, they're being raided here quite heavily. I'm not really into. Um, f you know, giving asking for something in return. I'm doing this. Although it seems I'm doing it out of the kindness of my heart, I'm actually doing it because it allows the Austrians to have a fighting chance against the Prussians, who are very, very unfriendly to us indeed. And also, it's going to give us—it's going to also give the Dutch a chance to build themselves up quite a substantial army um, and get themselves into a position where they can actually fight the Prussians as well. I know this is a pretty slow episode at the moment in terms of fighting, but I just want to get. You know, I want to get myself in a position where when I do fight, I'm going to be in the I'm going to be in the best position I can be. Is there any more trade agreements we can throw out there? <coughs> I don't believe so. Nope, there is nothing yet. And we're starting to build up a f some forces now that are going to hold. Um, I got two more going there, so that's great. We've got, we're going to start to hold these entrances here. To, oh, that's it. Don't do it, France. Don't do it. Don't do it. What can Austria do? Oh, they've done it! Austria have done it. Austria have fought back against the Prussians. That is fantastic news. See, with not even getting involved militarily, we have managed to, to shift the balance of power in the centre of Europe by just giving some nations some technology. It has enabled us to shift the entire balance of power. I know the Austrians are going to be pretty strong, but uh, you know we are controlling pretty much what happens through diplomatic channels, through dipl diplomacy, we are controlling what's going on in the region. They sacrifice themselves to rid themselves of the pirates. That is so, so excellent news that the Austrians are fighting back. We can have a strong, strong ally at our doorstep. It's going to be brilliant. Oh boy. The whole plot thickens. Wow. Right, states. Pirates, oh, they've moved away to the Spanish. You could, oh, maybe not. Oh, Gordon Bennett, there it is. This is the fight. 
This is the fight. We're going to take this fight. We are definitely going to take this fight. Look how many guns they've got. That is a staggering amount of guns. So that means I've got to strike these pretty hard. I want to rid myself of all of these. We've only got one gun here. But this cavalry is going to be vitally important. Okay, I'm going to take this fight, my friends. Let's do this. The Third Battle of Paris begins. If I can rid myself of this army... We can do ourselves a, a, a really a good service here. I'm going to aim straight for their guns, because those guns can do a tremendous amount of damage. They've got a, a huge amount of guns. So I let them I let them come in. I let them, you know, come towards the fort. Once they've moved out towards the fort, I'll use my cavalry to flank around them, wipe those guns out, and I mean absolutely shatter those guns, and then use my cavalry to pick off the remainder of the forces that are sort of fleeing. I need to rid myself of this rebel army. going to be a really really good fight for us in terms of ridding ourselves hopefully of an, a real enemy right these gentlemen are going to be placed here to the side here let's get them in diamond formation uh, we're going to have our general here hidden behind this building here which is going to give him plenty of cover should they start firing over the top our cannon, which is a solitary cannon, which means I'm going to have to put some more cannons into this army. Wait a minute. Whoa! It still hasn't repaired. I have to repair this. Drat, look at that. Okay, so just to prevent any unwanted visitors, I'm going to place my cannon there, put it on cannons to shot. And should anybody decide to come in through here, they shall have a nasty surprise. Right. I've got a feeling they might try and punch a hole through here, but I intend to cover the main axes. So let's just get everything as we should. Oh, hoo -hoo. Put them on line, seventh line infantry up here. I actually want to keep some of these these elite units out of harm's way. Um, I'm going to use a, at least a 20 second here. Uh, fourth Grenadiers, they can come down off the wall. Tenth Regiment of Foot, they can go here. I'm going to cover as many sides as we possibly can. Oh, Royal Irish, definitely the Royal Irish out of the way. Thank you very much. Uh, you gentlemen are going to remain... Thank you very much. 33rd of foot, they're going to come off the line here. Who's the 4th regiment in here? I want to try and keep as many of these units in good order without having to use them. So I want to tuck them in as close as I can here. Uh, you know, sort of keep them not hidden out of harm's way, but out of harm's way as best I possibly can. If that makes any sense at all. Might lose some to some you know, artillery shots, but. You know, that's the way it goes, I guess, sometimes. We're going to try and keep some of them hidden out of the way. i put those there. Let's put these in close to that building here. Uh, these can go here. That's the 11th foot. Actually, the 11th foot can probably go up on the wall. That's going to leave the Scots Guards here. And we've got the 12th Regiment. I'll just put a regiment just behind us here, just in case. You never know. Okay, I think we're good to go here, my friends. Uh, let's do this. There they are. There they are. Oh, God, I want to absolutely wipe the floor with these. That's where they're aiming for, right there. So we're going to just shift our lines a little bit. This is indestructible here, so this area is going to go. Which means we might get a few visitors. Which means I can move these back. 
Is it going to be moved back out of harm's way? They're going to, I'm going to absolutely wipe the floor with these. Ooh. Oh, some beautiful shots. Be careful. Be careful there, gentlemen. And so you shall perish. Oh my Gordon Bennett, they've taken a real hit there, oh there it is there, look at that hit, they've taken my word, second regiment there, right, let's get stuck into these, please, oh, I beg your pardon my friends for hitting that all the time, I didn't mean to do it, I am, um, Hopefully I've kept that, that attack down to a minimum. Ah, look at that, I knew it. Oh, 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 oh. What a beautiful sight, and they took a real beating there. Right, that's the end of that army. Now I can set myself up to deal with... Ah, there it is. Oh, they're already shattered. Doesn't matter. <laughs> oh, they're shattered. Oh, but they are. They should be shattered now. Yeah, they're going. They're going. Try and come through that gap. They're gonna, they're gonna get some muskets in the face. And the battle, yes, easy as that was a beautiful battle. We destroyed most of that army. It's gone. I'm hoping to be able to at least punch through this now, rid myself of these rebels, bring France completely into our control, when we lose 66 men is all we lost. That was a fantastic fight. Okay, yes, rebels are dead. That was a great, great thing. Social contract. Ooh. So we might have stolen something there, which is excellent for us. We're getting all this new technology. Oh, yes. <laughs> Excellently done. Ooh. Wittenberg has come back. 
and looks like Prague Prague has been taken Prague has been taken wow that is what I'm talking about right there right there my friends and the Dutch are really starting to pour some troops into this now so Wuttenberg have come back European China now who did we lose uh, we lost some gentlemen there and we lost some there and we lost some there Sorry about that, my friends. I just had a phone call in. Okay, so I think we can probably start repairing some of these here now. We've managed to remove that. That school. Yes, we're going to start putting some money back into the economy here. Uh, yeah, let's start repairing some of these buildings. And for this army here is going to require a general. Adrian Channing. One more turn there. I think we'll recruit another unit there. And this navy, yes indeed, this navy is going to get another fifth rate there as well. So we're starting to put together all the pieces we need here. <laughs> Oh yes, thank you very much, good sir. Actually, want? he can come back and he can be... Although, can I get anything from there, I wonder? Oh, classical university. I'm going to try and... Without and try and steal some research. Ah, uh, Wittenberg has come back. I'm hoping that Austria is going to do the business here. Uh, Austria. Can't give me anything else there yet at the moment. Looks like our allies are indeed coming back very strongly indeed. Uh, Ordnance factory. No, I don't need that yet. I'm not going to build. I'm not going to build any more troops here. Did I lose any cab? Oh, I did. Anybody else? I lost nothing at all. Uh, I'm probably going to need. Actually, I'll probably build myself another cannon. Oh no, let's get a demi cannon. And what can I build here anything? Nope. Military Academy is going to give me Royal Highland Grenadiers. They're definitely going to be taking part in the fighting in Europe. And we have three here, three horse. I'm going to wait for the Highland Grenadiers to come available. Ah, look at that. Did not do that, which is a bit silly of me there. And we're securing these troops finally against the Spanish. Is Portugal an ally of ours? No, they're not. Oh, there. I was. Oh. I 
think I'll give them ring bayonet because that will enable them to fight the. Oh damn, they're allied with Spain. Damn it, I'd given Portugal that. Didn't notice that. Oh, well, my mistake. Not to worry, that was my mistake. Whoa, whoa, whoa. 160. No, I don't think so. Oh damn, the mines there. Yeah, 107. Get them to full spec. That's okay. I won't put any money into there yet because I've got this army here that's going to be loitering about still. But I can't wait to get this army across. Uh, what have we got coming in? 6905. Trade is being... Oh, trade is fully open. And look at these ministers. Absolutely fantastic. I did have some excellent advice as well about trading my American... Uh, areas here, my Americas, my Americas, sort of territories, for some territories to the Mughal. Um, I have tried that. I wonder which areas they would be prepared to give. Um, for Kashmir. I wonder if I can get a play area up in Kashmir here. That might be a. I might. What's Kashmir's income like? I think I'll just wait. I think I'll wait a, a, a while. I'll tell you that. But it is excellent advice. You've given me some excellent advice. Um, if 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 my friends, um, I remember I've, I've recorded this sort of a day, um, you know, previous. So if I've missed any comments with anybody wanting uh, units renamed that I've missed, I do apologise. But I have, I've probably, I might have recorded this before your request came in. So, but if I have missed any, I promise you, the next time I record my one of my British Great Britain campaign uh, episodes, I will rename the units you've asked, my friends. So please forgive me if I haven't done it yet, but I, it will be done. Okay, let's end this turn. I might make this my last turn here. Oh, here we go. I'm not sure if we can hold up here, but... Oh, drats. I think we can take care of those eventually, but... We're at, whoa! Wow, they've taken a real thrashing there. Don't do it, don't do it, don't do it. They've done it. The Ottomans are sending an absolute ton of armies up there. Sweden. It's a bit decent fleet they got there, Wittenberg. All United States. Pirates. Boo. Ooh, they moved away. Now they've come back. That's fine. Ooh, explosive shell. Ho oh, oh, ho oh. ho. And I th think what we will do is use these to remove that. <laughs> Thank you very much. Good sir. And we should move these into here. Um, and we are then... We've got this fleet here. It's probably good enough to take out this one here. Uh, we can probably rid ourselves finally of that French scourge there.
I can be upgraded. Research we can steal. Oh, indeed. I think we'll go for measuring tools. Excellent. Oh, Could it be? Could it be? Ah. I think we shall go for a craft workshop. But not yet. That's too much money just yet, there, my friends. But we are going to open up these farms. Damn, that's a lot of troops. This army still hasn't done anything as yet, so we will probably be moving these out eventually, but I'm going to bring this under further control. bring all of these gentlemen up to full. Okay, one more turn, my friends, because then... Oh, there they are. We can get four of them. Four Royal Highland Grenadiers. I am all over that like a rash. I'm going to put four in here. That'll take me to there. One more of these, one more unit will do it, and then we are going to... St we're going to go to... France and we are going to thrash the French. One, this is my, this will be my last moments, barring any disasters. Hmm. Oh, look at that! Got to get rid of that force there. Prussia, what are you going to do, Prussia? Anything of any note? Poland, Lithuania? Russia, Sweden. Pueblo Nation or Dagestan. United States is getting on, I wonder. <laughs> wow, they actually left me alone. Unbelievable. <laughs> Excellent. And then we're going to move these gentlemen to here. These gentlemen will be moved to here. Ship's orders received. <laughs> oh my word, look at that. Three of those. Wait a minute. Rats. Keep trying, keep trying. You try and get that if you can. Savoy have got that. Oh, that's still on fire there. How else can I support them? to keep 
keep them afloat. I've got to keep them with the, that back up of them. That is a gigantic. F Whoa, they're even going further. They're going to the next one again. Oh, wow. They're going to be really, really, really strong. Which is good for us. Believe me, that is so good for us. Give them condensed marching. Oh, wow. Okay, United States, how are they doing? Let's have a look and see how they're. So, whoa, United States, yikes. The United States has really, really thrown themselves here. How are they doing? Who are they at war with? Oh, they're at war with the Iroquois. Right. I'm going to send them the basic steam pump. But they are really powering through the United States. I'm glad I got them as an ally there. Remember, I'm just, all of this I'm doing for my own end, as it were. I've got to try and keep myself um, ahead of the game here. I, I can get heavy cavalry, probably. I just need one more here. And I think I shall get myself another ship because um, to do otherwise would not be too good. Well, opera House. Nope. I can actually put the money I think into this army here that needs it. So I managed to get those two, those three up to to full spec. So that's fine. But I think I'm going to end this episode here, my friends. Ooh, hello. I can put some money into this as well. What will that give me? That will give me Dockyard. I'm actually going to go down. I'm actually going to put some, I think I'll put some into some ship technology. I go for that. Naval shore facilities, I'll just open up the the naval op option to us a little bit more. But anyway, my friends, I'm going to end this episode here. Hope you've enjoyed it. It's been one we've sort of, you know, starting to rebuild and sort of just, you know, bring everything back under our control, as it were. Keep things and try and keep the French limited to what they were doing. We do have to just get rid of this army here, which is going to be a bit of a nuisance for us, I think, until it's absolutely eliminated. So there's a... No, I'm going to actually send this force that's here. Uh, that's going to be sent straight to uh, Flanders. Uh, no questions asked. It's going straight there. And we're going to batter down the door here. We're going to give the Dutch a bit of a reprieve. We can also probably, hopefully, m also mean we can then back the Dutch up if the, if the Prussians come up against them. But it looks like... Yeah, uh, it looks like, the hopefully... Um, the Austrians are going to be able to hold this area they've been given, or they, they've kept, they've taken Prague back. Hopefully they can stretch in further. We've got a strong ally here in the region that's going to give us a lot of time and to be able to sort of, you know, our own goal, which is India. And if I can leave my allies to fight the wars in Europe after I've dealt with the French here, uh, then that is going to give us... Um, that's going to give us some very, very nice opportunities in India. So if I can basically clear out France, remove them here altogether, build up a strong defensive formation here, that means I can then focus on India and I can hopefully leave my allies to fight these wars. Uh, the Dutch can then sort of start to expand and the Austrians can start to expand and deal with all of these and then we can go off to India and do our thing there and hopefully take India which is believe me that's going to be a long campaign a long campaign 
Um, it's going to take a lot of men to do it. But anyway, I hope you've enjoyed this, my friends. If you have, please comment, like, and subscribe. And as always, your comments down below will always be welcome. Please forgive me if you if I haven't renamed any of the units. I may have recorded this before you put any of your re you know your sort of comments down to rename a unit. If you have, I will definitely do it next turn because I don't want to have a battle next turn. So I'll make sure I do rename some units. Uh, until then, my friends, I promise you many more battles to come and a lot more you know, strategic sort of thinking in terms of what we're going to do here in Europe. Get rid of the French in its entirety from Europe, and then we can focus on what our real mission is, our real goal, and that is India. But until then, hope you've had a good week up to now. Until then, my friends, bye for now.